I'd like to welcome you guys back to more Assassin's Creed 3. Uh, you're probably wondering where we are right now. I've got us to our mission, which took about 10 minutes to get to in real life. Uh, but uh, first of all, uh, one of the recordings got deleted, so actually you're not going to be able to see that. But basically what happened was, Haytham uh, kills <laughs> kills um, that general, or whatever. Not, not, not the general, he kills, he kills someone. I can't remember who he is. But, uh, yeah, he kills him, and, uh, and yeah, that, that's really about it. So he kills him, and then, uh, there's a cutscene where he looks at that, uh, Indian girl he treated, and they, like, wink at each other, and, uh, he does, like, a little monologue saying it's been months, still hasn't heard anything from that, uh, Indian girl, who will actually turn out to be Connor's mother, so, let's start sequence three, Unconvinced. Have you found her? Uh, she's made camp not too far from here. Excellent. Well, the sooner we're done, the sooner we can get out of this cold. Okay, so looks like we have to mount the horse and actually looks like we're going to find that we'll girl as well. I'm afraid I have some bad news, sir. Oh? Braddock is insisting I return to service under him. I've tried to beg off to no avail. No doubt he's still angry about losing Pitcairn. To say nothing of the shaming we gave him. Do as he asks. In the meantime, put my I'll work on having you released. I'm sorry for the <laughs> trouble. Not your fault. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we're just gonna... Here we are, then. We're too late. Fire's only just been snuffed. Snow recently disturbed. She's close. Bollocks. Huh. <laughs> These tracks are fresh. It must be hers. Mm. Seems she took to higher ground. Out of the snow and into the trees. I don't actually remember Charles Lee following us, so this is a new cutscene, I believe, or uh, a new thing like that. <laughs> Let's get up here then. <laughs> uh, all right, so here's the tracks. Then we have to follow the these then. <laughs> There we are. Oh, here she is. Wait here. Charles, before he grows suspicious. <laughs> I can handle things from here. But sir! But nothing! Go! Stop running! I only wish to talk! <laughs> no, he just stands there. Your enemy! <laughs> Please just hear me out! God's woman! Only let me speak! <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> Easy. All right, got him as well, and I think there's one more. Yeah, where are you? Where are you? Come on. <laughs> All right, nice. I love the music to this. Like, it's just so tribal. It really just does fit the theme. Uh, kill him. I thought wolves were passive. I mean, in Minecraft they are. But I believe this is not Minecraft, so I need to stop talking. So we're going to climb up here. I don't think he can climb trees. Yeah, he can't. 
Well, it's common sense. She's right up there. Like, what? You can't you see her. Patience, no. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Climb. Right, nice. Nice. Can you do that? Wow, what the hell? Okay, looks like you can't. Yeah, Haytham can't climb trees, but Connor can. I, I guess that really makes uh, Connor more badass, the fact that he's he's more tribal to be able to do that. Are you touched in the head? Is it? Me, Haytham. I come in peace. Why are you speaking so slow? <sighs> Sorry. What do you want? Well, your name, for one. I'm Gadzi Zio. Oh, pleased to meet you. God, God's day. Just call me Zio. Dio. Zio. <laughs> Dio. Now tell me why it is you're here. Where did you get this? From an old friend. I've only seen such markings in one other place. Where? Well, it is forbidden for me to speak of it. I saved your people. Does this mean nothing to you? Look, I am not the enemy. Close to here, there is a hill. Meet me there, and we'll see if you speak the truth. Uh, w wait, what hill? Fuck. She's gone. Damn it. I love how she says there's a hill, but if we all look around, there's shitloads of hills and mountains, so I, I'm not really 100... Is... Oh. Oh, what? Why did... Is she's right? Never mind. Ne never mind, guys. Never mind. <laughs> that town hosts soldiers who seek to drive my people from these lands. They're led by a man known as the Bulldog. Edward Braddock. You know him? He is no friend of mine. Every day, more of my people are lost to men like him. <laughs> then I suggest we put a stop to it. Together. What do you propose? That we kill Edward Braddock. But first, we have to find him. Oh, that's easy. Not really. All right. Uh. <laughs> there we go. Leave of faith. <laughs> I don't trust you. I know. Yet you remain. But I might prove you wrong. Let's it go. It will not happen. So you say. <laughs> so I know. Weird. Yet, I remain. <laughs> Alright, we have to go into this bar here. Ah, uh, this is the Fight Club. Ah, uh, I remember this. <laughs> Wait here. A Mohawkman is likely to raise suspicions, if not muskets. This is hardly the first time I've been amongst your people. I can handle myself. That is a new cutscene. They never said that. They I never said so. that. They never said that. She just said, I can handle myself, and that was it. All right, sir. <laughs> Can't stand being caught there. The endless crashing of the waves, the sting of the salt in the eyes, and the goddamn gulls shrieking and shitting everywhere. You're sure that's where we're going? Aye. The bulldogs putting together another expedition. <laughs> that's what they're calling them now. Expeditions. Aye. Smart too. Slap a fancy name on something, and all evil is excused. All right then, so let's go over to these guys, and then uh, I believe that's the last one. Wait, what? Wait, wait, whoa, 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 wait! What did I do wrong there? Hold on a minute. Huh? What the hell did I just do wrong? Huh? Right, let's do that one first to see what I did wrong. That doesn't make any sense at all. Huh? All right. All right. All right. All right. Whoa, 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 what's going on? There we go. Positions. Wonder what Braddock intends to do about it. He's already left for the advance camp. 
I'll wager our little holiday here is just about ended. We'll be marching south before weeks end. These guys look identical. That's creepy. Fucking hell. Alright, and then let's just do these guys again, and then that's it. Stand being quartered there. The endless crashing of the waves. The sting of the salt in my eyes. And the goddamn gulls shrieking and shitting everywhere. You're sure that's where we're going? Aye. The Bulldog's putting together another expedition. That's what they're calling them now. Expeditions. Aye. Smart too. Slap a fancy name on something and all evil is excused. Ain't that the truth. Alright then, so... That's all then. <laughs> Oi! Where are you going, Cully? Me? No, the other cock robin. Well, I, um... Uh, I was leaving. Oh? And now? <laughs> well, now... I'm going to feed you your teeth. <laughs> and you were worried I was going to be the problem? <laughs> oh, this is going to be good. Alright. Oh, shit! Fucking hell, this game! Oh, shit! Ooh! Fucking hell. What? I've never even seen some of these fucking moves before. What's this guy doing? Shit, man. Fucking <laughs> 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 Christ. What the f- Holy shit, did you guys hear that? That noise, bloody hell. They got shitted on, fucking hell. You're hurt. Oh, that's nothing. <laughs> Here. This should stop the bleeding. It wasn't necessary. But thank you. We should move on. Meet me at Braddock's camp when you're ready. I actually like these new cutscenes. They're actually quite good, actually. I mean, that one was there, but that was actually just a sped up version of it. Alright, so we have to go over to Braddock's thingy scene. I'm not sure what that is. Uh, huh. Alright, let's just look at our map before we go any further. Alright, so we need to go all the way over there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to skip to there. And uh, I'll see you guys when I get there.